maths uh, assessment uh, and tomorrow you have social studies uh, test for uh, tomorrow you have assessment for the social studies tomorrow so i think you already uh, read all the book of the social study uh, that's very interesting book uh, for grade 3 so uh, today we'll start from mountains so basit uh, i will ask a question from you uh, can i ask a question from you uh, uh, Basit, what is the uh, what is the highest mountain in the world? Uh, Mount Everest. Mount Everest. Uh, good. Ma, where is located? Nepal. Okay, good. Uh, Mount Everest is located in Nepal. Uh, what is the height of the Mount Everest? Eight thousand eight hundred forty-eight. Very good. Mount Everest height is. 8,848 meter. Uh, its summit is always covered with snow. Kya um, matlab? Summit mean peak. Yeah. Iska jo peak hai na, hamesha uh, uh, jo hai na barf se daga hota hai. Uh, Basit, what is the difference between mountains and hills? Mountains is bigger than hill. Mountains are uh, uh, mountains are higher and steeper than hills. Yeah. Uh, me that uh, uh, Mount Everest is the highest mountain in the world. Uh, okay, can you tell me which one is the highest mountain in the in the Pakistan? K2. K2, okay, good. Uh, okay, can you explain me about uh, this graph? Uh, uh, can you explain me uh, about uh, the peak, slope and uh, foothills? Peak or summit means the top of a mountain is called okay. a summit or peak. Jo, achha, top of the mountain ko kehte hai, summit or peak. Okay. And the side of the mountain is called slope. slope. And the small hills at the bottom of the hill is called foothills. foothills. Uh, how you define valley? A valley is an area of low land between hills or mountains. Okay, valley is an area around the mountains. Okay, uh, mountains are found all over the world and even under the ocean. Okay, ocean may be what they almost seventy percent of the earth planet is covered by oceans. Okay, and uh, Pakistan has many mountains, they include uh, some of the highest in the world. So we will mostly explain about the uh, Pakistan region, okay? Okay, Basi, this is the map of Pakistan, okay? Uh, Pakistan is covered by mountains. Uh, Basi, uh, uh, Basi, do you know that uh, uh, five of the fourteen, uh, five out of fourteen highest peaks in the world are situated in Pakistan. Mm. Most of them are part of Karakoram range. Mm. Uh, can you tell me the highest mountain peaks of Pakistan with uh, some height? K2, Nanga Parvat, Kashar Brahm 1, Broad Peak and Kashar Brahm 2. Okay, uh, there are five highest mountain peaks of uh, in Pakistan. Uh, first one is K2, uh, height with uh, 8611 meter, Nanga Parvat, 8126 meter, mm. uh, Gashan Brahm 1, 8080 meter, Broad Peak, 8051 meter, uh, Gashan Brahm 2, 8035 meter. Mm. Uh, uh, can you tell me uh, how you define about the mountain range? A group or chain of mountains is called is close together is called a mountain range. Okay, uh, the oh. a group or chain of mountains close together 
uh, is a mountain, mountain range. Mountain Pakistan has many mountain ranges. The Karakoram range has the largest mountains. number of tall peaks of uh, any a mountain range in the world. It includes K2. Uh, do, uh, do you know K2 is the number one, uh, is the highest mountain in Pakistan, but uh, mm. K2 is the uh, uh, K2 is the second highest mountains in the world. Okay. Oh, okay, Basit, can you tell me what is the longest mountain range in the world? Mm, the longest mountain range is the Indus Range in South America. South America. Uh, Indus in the South America. It's more than 7,000 kilometers long. Oh, good. Uh, this information I was not aware of this information so next we will study about mountain passes okay Basit I am asking you a question uh, there are five peaks uh, in Pakistan uh, can you tell me the mountain range uh, Karakoram range okay Karakoram range there uh, there most of them are part of the Karakoram range Okay, Basit, can you tell me about the Khyber Pass and Khunjraj Pass? Uh, First, uh, can you tell me what is pa uh, what is mountain pass? A pass is a route through ma a mountain range. Okay, uh, can you tell me about Khunjraj uh, Khunjra Pass? Khunjra Pass links Pakistan with China. Okay, and it's located uh, Khunjra Pass in Gilgit Baltistan. It links Pakistan with China. Okay. Mm. Okay, Basit, can you tell me something about the life in the mountains? Uh, many people use natural resources and their houses are made of adobe. This is a brick that is made from clay and dried hard in the sun. Uh, okay, Basit, uh, can you tell me about the uh, living in the mountain uh, areas in Pakistan? Uh, can you tell me about uh, uh, farmer build uh, different uh, they grow different foods uh, can you tell me uh, what uh, food they grow in Hunza mm, barley apricots apples pears peaches plums grapes and figs good uh, and uh, mining is also carried out in the mountains uh, of the Hunza and Swat mm. uh, can you tell me some James stones uh, the found there in that area rubies tupas garnets emeralds and spires okay good okay thank you this is uncle ji this is uncle ji hello uncle ji oh my god diamond Okay, Basit, can you tell me the fact about the people living in the Huns and northern areas? Uh, they they have some healthy lifestyle. Uh, mm. Why? Uh, because they live uh, they live a natural life. Uh, they they eat uh, their diet is their diet is natural. Their lifestyle is natural. Sure. They're very hard working uh, people and. Uh, water and uh, they they have clean air and uh, they take a fresh fruit okay no oh, okay basit can you tell me about the mountains animals of pakistan the snow leopard marhur and musk deer living in the mountains of northern pakistan are endangered species this means that there are so few of them left in the wild that they may soon die out. Endangered ka hai they, uh, they need to reserve? Yeah. Ye kaun animal hai? Marhor. Ye marhor hai. Thikye? Yani mountain animals mein kya hai? Snow leopard, marhor and musk deer living in the mountains. Okay. We should protect the, uh, we should protect it, okay? Oh, uh, Basit, can you tell me about some birds? Uh, Mermots, eagles, wolves, and porcupines. Porcupines also live here? Yeah. Okay.
Okay. Uh, okay. Uh, can you tell me uh, what what fruits are grown in Hunza? Uh, barley, apricots, apples, pears, peaches, plums, and grapes and figs. Okay. Good. What uh, James stones or mined in Hunza in Swat? Ruby, rubies. Uh, Tupas, garnets, emeralds, and spires. Okay, good. Okay, Basit, we will proceed to the next topic that living in the mountains of in Peru. Uh, as you can see here, this is the some terraces in Peru. This is ancient one, and this is the uh, house in Peru. This I think this is old uh, in in ancient uh, in old days. The people used to build these houses. Uh, first, you should know that uh, Peru is a Peru is a country in South America. Okay, okay. you can study it in, on map. Okay, mm. if you study map, uh, so you can find Peru. Okay, you can f you can uh, study it uh, from the map. Where is located? Okay, this is you can find in this map. Uh, can you uh, tell me? Wow. Here. Okay. Uh, can you show me uh, this is the Peru this is the South America Wow this one okay okay I never studied about this uh, country so uh, we are talking about uh, this country because uh, okay Basit we are talking about Peru mountains uh, because uh, uh, most of the people live in the mountains uh, uh, Bas, can you read this passage? Long ago, the people of Peru built traces on the mountain sloops to grow their crops. In this way, they could use the mountains as well as the valleys for growing food. Today, farmers still use these traces. The most common crops grown in Peru are potatoes and maize. Okay, the most common crops grown in Peru are potatoes and maize. Okay. Okay, Basit, this is very interesting. Uh, I never studied about this the uh, first time I am studying with you. Uh, in uh, this country, uh, Peru is actually a mountain area. Most of the people live in mountains. So, the people extract some very important natural resources such as copper, gold, silver and zinc. Uh, when they extract, uh, so they are, uh, because of mining, there is air pollution. Uh, so, this is very important for the country to have reserve, to have money, uh, uh, to, uh, to sell stones and uh, some gems. It's very important, but uh, uh, but there's some also some effect. It causes some problem. It can spoil the land and cause pollution. Do you understand? Yes. Can you tell me about this fact? Llamas only have two toes on each foot. This is the special animal. No, it is a common animal. Okay, Basit, uh, this chapter is very interesting about mountains. Uh, so, we are discussing about Peru country. Peru country is located in, in uh, uh, which uh, uh, continent? Uh, South America. South America, okay. Uh, so, ca can you tell me about mountain animals uh, in Peru? There are alpacas and llamas, trout, yellowtail, woolly monkey. Uh, mountain tapir and Andean condor and jaguar, but the they are endangered animals. Uh, okay. Uh, can you tell me more about these animals? Um, what are the benefits of these animals? Alpaca and llamas are used for transport. They also give milk and wool. Uh, trout fish. Their wool is used to make clothing. Yes. As in bugs and trout, uh, you know, in Swat River there are too many trout. Yes, but uh, in S South America, trout is endangered. Okay. Uh, why have they become endangered? Because one, because they have lost their habitat, because humans have destroyed their habitats by chopping trees and mining. 
building okay. houses and roads uh, first we should know about habitat habitat is a natural home of the animal habitat plant. is uh, is a place where something lives okay these animals are in danger because the, of their loss of their uh, habitat okay so there should be some ban on chopping down the trees building houses and roads okay uh, so now we can proceed uh, uh, can you tell me some other uses of mountains mountains are very popular f with, with tourists do puri duniya ki tourist pakistan aate hain theek hai har saal to see the five five important peaks in pakistan out of 14 Mm. Uh, do you know five peaks ko to nahi bole five peaks ke naam batao chalo uh, kitu nanga parvat gasharbram 1 mm. broad peak and gasharbram 2 very good very good ye gasharbram ka naam main bhul jata hu acha uh, where is peru hmm? uh, peru is in south america very good uh, अच्छा ये बाकी तो आपको आते हैं ठीक है यू ऑलरेडी राइट ऑन योर योर नोटबुक पूछो कैन यू नेम थ्री थिंग्स माइंड इन फेरो सिल्वर गोल्ड एंड जिंक वेरी गुड एंड आल्सो कॉपर ओके कैन यू टेल मी व्हाई द पीपल विजिट माउंटेन इन पाकिस्तान बिकॉज़ दे एंजॉय स्पोर्ट्स सच एज़ स्कीइंग एंड ट्रैकिंग they walk high they do climb they climb the mountain or do hiking and and trekking etc uh oh you also like to walk in the mountains i know uh, uh, but tourists can also cause some problems some of these problems are noise, noise pollution, pollution litter littering the land and water eros erosion erosion wearing away why wearing away of the land caused by too many people trekking or climbing okay. the mountains i think this not too much big problem uh, cutting down trees to build uh, places for people to stay mm. uh, so i think there are so many uh, benefits uh, for the economy especially for the economy of the country uh, tourism is very important okay mm. finally okay uh, so we are uh, almost uh, going to end this chapter so i lo- also learned so many thing from you mm. okay uh so now we will summarize this chapter uh, what to have uh, uh basit uh, mm-hmm. what we learned about mountains um that uh, mount can you read the key facts uh, can you read the summary pakistan has many mountain ranges kitu is the highest mountain in pakistan a mountain pass is a route through a mountain A mountain range is a group of mountain close together. Mountains have lots of natural resources, things from nature that we can use such as water, soil, plants, oil and gold. Peru is a mountainous country in South America. Humans can damage mountains and animal is in danger when there are few of its kind left in the wild animals can become endangered due to loss of habitat okay uh, now you can write true and false okay the top of mountain is called uh summit or peak it true or false true true good must be a f recording The highest mountain in the world is Kitu. No, it's false. False. Uh, Kitu to uh, second number pe hai na? Acha uh, next. The highest mountain in Pakistan is Mount Everest. No, false. Hmm. Ye pencil se nahi karna? No, I don't. Acha. Kitu is the fourth highest mountain in the world. No. World mein second number pe. The Khyber Pass links Pakistan with Iran. No. तो करेक्ट है खैबर पास लिंक पाकिस्तान विद अफगानिस्तान ठीक है यस 
Farmers in Peru build trees and mountain slopes to grow their food. Mm, true. True. Yes. Tourists can cause damage to mountains. True. Kaisi damage kaisi karte hain mountain ko? Tourist ke to mountain ko kis tarah damage karte hain? I think this sentence is not clear. Tourist can cause damage to mountains. हाँ इसका ये मतलब है कि वो to for their stay, the people make hotels and they chop down the trees. That's why. Okay. Okay. Next, it it number eight. It's done. The animal condors. ये कौन animal का नाम है? कौन सा ही अच्छा ये ईगल टाइप है अच्छा 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 लिव्स इन पाकिस्तान ये पाकिस्तान में है नो हम्म हम्म ओके बात से तो द दिस वन द टाइप ऑफ ईगल इंडियन कॉन्ड लिव्स इन पाकिस्तान फॉल्स यस द मार्कोर इज एन इंडेंजर्ड एनिमल ऑफ पाकिस्तान यस ट्रू ये इंडेंजर अच्छा नेक्स्ट वन पढ़ो the Khunjara Pass links Pakistan with China. True. Okay, true. Hai. Ye to bahut easy hai. Ye mujhe hai mili, so, this is very easy. This animal is very easy. This animal is This is the summary of this unit. Uh, so, we completed the unit uh, for the mountains. Uh, so, Basit uh, has an assessment for tomorrow uh, for the social studies. So, uh, endangered animals ke baare mein kya kya Draw and color a poster about uh, how to see endangered animals. Include these things on post. Okay, you Baba. already did on your notebook. Okay. Baba. Thank you. Baba. Thank you. Thank you, Basit. Baba. Okay, Basit, thank you. Okay, Basit, we learned so many things. Thank you very much. Uh, uh, <coughs> Sakib, <laughs> Sakib is disturbing. <laughs> Sakib is uh, trying to disturb us. So, <laughs> thank you very much. Uh, okay, okay. Uh, enjoy your dinner. Okay.